Hey, hey, how doing? Holmes here and welcome back to some more Rise of the Ronin boss guy. Today we are going to be taking on Takamori Psycho. So this fight is kind of different, I guess. Uh, he calls in his dog when you drop his HP down to around 80%. And there's a few moves I want to bait. The rush attack, this move right here, the rushing red grab, parry that. You can get in uh, Izuna drop or using the Hayabusa Ryu style here. This red attack, it's easy to parry, but I always like, well, I miss it like 50% of the time. And be careful about getting hit by it, because you see how he kind of like, freaking yeets you off the cliff. Um, when that happens, make sure you use your grapple to pull yourself back, otherwise it's going to send you off the cliff, and if you fall off the cliff, that's, that's extra damage, and it's probably going to kill you. So the attacks we're baiting is the red attack, the combo attack. Okay, that's not it. Sometimes he does mix it, mix in the red attack with the combos, so be careful. But I'm basically trying to bait him to do a jumping attack to start things off. Yeah, that was not part of the plan. Getting whacked and killed there. That was not part of the plan, so I'm gonna pick myself up here. Alright, let's 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 try this. Right this time. Okay, let's see. He mixed up his red attack there. And now we parry that. Okay, we got the stun. Get the crit. Now the dog comes in. When the dog comes in, just don't even worry about it. Uh, most of the time, your ally will take care of the dog, so just focus on Saigo here. That rushing attack where he just does the tackle, you can parry it or you can just simply block it or dodge it. There's a red rushing attack again, parry. He's gonna drop. Alright, one, two, three, four. Oh, hit the attack, make sure you grapple back. You see, he sends you off the cliff there. Alright, so it's either gonna be most of the attacks are either gonna be a three hit combo or a four hit combo. So, and it's the same rhythm. So, one, two, three, four. And then once you get the fourth parry or the third parry, uh, you'll be able to stun him. So it's it's either one, uh, three or four. <laughs> uh, the timing is more or less the same, like one, two, three, four, it's like that. It's not like the the beat is not. Um, there's no like weird lag to it or anything like that. It's the same. So you see, after he does the palm slap, uh, it's gonna be an overhead. But sometimes you will just skip the palm slap and then he just goes for the third attack and then you can parry it. It's, like I said, it's <laughs> whatever the boss is fearing, I guess. Also, if you're getting overwhelmed by the attacks, feel free to switch to your allies um, and then just let the AI do the dodging. Here he ended up getting, I thought I was going to kill him with the, with the crit there, but he ended up surviving and he got the hit off of me instead. And I didn't want to refight him just to make sure my character survives so yeah anyways uh that's it for takamori psycho and here's my equips going into this fight for ninja set which you can get by maxing out sawamura's bond level uh here's my curatives and here's my stats in case you guys are wondering what i have on and here's my style and here is the difficulty i'm playing on and yeah that's pretty much gonna wrap it up for this video so i thank you all so very much for watching hopefully this video has helped if you are struggling against this boss and if it did hopefully y'all will stay tuned for more but until next time hope to catch y'all later homes out